Hi, my name is John Duffy. I'm the Vice President of the Utility Workers Union of America. You know, this is a very, very important year. It's gotten to the point in this country where both political parties have to admit that working people haven't had a real raise in over 30 years. But it was the policies of people on the right that caused that. And, but those same people on the right have to admit that this is happening and, and want the American public to believe that they have the answer. And unfortunately for us in the labor movement, their answer has been to attack labor unions. The one entity that's out there to get people raises, they want to eliminate and destroy. So we can see where we're headed and the choices we have to make, and they're pretty clear. We have endorsed Hillary Clinton. She's the only candidate I've seen that's gone out and actually mentioned the words collective bargaining and is fully supportive of that. Where we have on the other side someone who talks about bringing jobs back, you know, but yet, you know, exports his jobs whenever he can. Everything about him and the party he belongs to, unfortunately, the reality is, and their track and record shows, that they are out to destroy the labor movement. That is for one reason and one reason only, so that the boss can determine what wages we earn. And we actually lift all boats. When the labor movement is strong, everybody does well in this country. So to me, the choice is very, very clear. Do we support someone like Hillary Clinton, who was actually advocated for collective bargaining, or someone who actually wants to destroy it. That person can't tell me that he's for the middle class. Absolutely not.